chief staff who are interested with the health conscious issues. Yeah, yeah it's they were very interesting. They were interested to get the book. It was printed now in the Philippines as well. Uh, of course, uh, this is claims. Uh, this is the seminar in, uh, at the University of Manila. Approximately 2,000 students participated. She's the owner of the university, Dr. Emilio, uh, and she's the one who hosted the seminar. And she believes on hot water. She's been using hot water for a long time because there were some rumors that Chinese, uh, Indians, in some places, people, they use hot water. When I went deep into the research, I asked Sri Lankans, I asked Indians, I asked, I say, this is a gift from God. Why didn't you continue? Why didn't you do research? A lot, most of the answers were that they got it from the grand grandfathers. And uh, of course, all of you know that uh, China is the one, the biggest producer of uh, 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 herbal medicine in the world. So, so they incline with the herbal medicine. But I'm going to have uh, to participate in a world inter international uh, book fair in China and other places where I'll show you later on. Uh, actually, two for, for book fair uh, in London, in New York, uh, Frankfurt, and in Beijing because Chinese also, and uh, in India also, I think they, some of them, or you, I mean, know about hot water. Yeah, yeah, this is just the glimpse of the interview, I mean, of the seminar. Yeah, this just uh, last two weeks, uh, seminar at the university, I mean, at the uh, embassy of the Philippines in Oman. Yeah, uh, this is, I participated in Oman Diabetic uh, Association, I mean, uh, open forum in uh, Al Sahwa Gardens. Uh, it was very interesting because uh, of a willing response from people and for me to know where did it go far, how people came to know more about this. So it's an open, uh, this is just one of the seminars conducted for it. This is a psoriasis. I got acquired psoriasis. My wife, she was panicking because she knows that there's no cure for psoriasis. And I say I will only use hot water. A part of drinking the hot water, I was taking, I put the hot water in the uh, bucket, I mean a uh, basin, and I apply every day. It's just here, and it's gone completely. If you see the report here, I even you can see the skin. Uh, it's opened up, uh, the skin brightening. Uh, actually, with the psoriasis, you can see the, uh, it's overwhelming figures. 7.5 to 8.5 million in the US itself, 125 people, million people around in the world, as you can see. It's overwhelming, and no cure for psoriasis. Yeah. Uh, this is one of the religious leaders. He was talking about uh, an old man on, uh, on his 60s. He got a problem with the prostate and was cured by just on his uh, about 60s uh, by dr drinking only pure hot water. So he was telling to people, go to the website, and uh, so on. He, he, refer, he gave the website. Uh, it's just appreciation from people. Uh, I don't think I need to go with this. This is just a Canadian teacher. She was cured, she was 35 years, she got a food poisoning. She's a teacher in college here. And she, when she heard that, that when I did seminar for her, and she was cured by only drinking hot water. She put in her report, if you wanted to go detail on this, I can provide you what she mentioned about this one. Uh, this is just to show you uh, how can it change. Uh, she's there, a friend of my wife, uh, you know, uh, changing, I mean, because it does three operations. It does three miraculous achievements. It melts the fat in your body, it neutralizes the toxins, and it kills harmful bacteria. Yeah. Okay, uh, I'll just go with the... All right. So, uh, with every any scientific discovery, you need to come with a formula to prove. Uh, here is the formula for, I got two formula for the hot water. Uh, water which contains two atoms, hydrogen, and one atom, oxygen. I call uh, water, I mean H2O, everybody knows about this. We need oxygen to breathe, so ex water equals life. The sun produces heat to kill harmful bacteria in the air, and that, so we can enjoy a healthy life. Without the sunshine, for a one hour, two scientists, the Downs and Blondes, in 1877, they discovered that if you don't have the sunlight, if they disappear for one hour, no living being can live. So it kills harmful bacteria in the air for us to li enjoy a healthy uh, I mean to be healthy. So, so the heat as well, it, as I, pre I said before, uh, destroy harmful bacteria, neutralize the toxin, and kills harmful bacteria. I mean, uh, uh, kills harmful bacteria in our body. Uh, melt the fat. Yeah. Uh, so sun, I call heat or hot. I got good health. So therefore, water plus heat, I call 
heart I mean I call healthy life life plus health so heart water I call healthy life I call miracle and it has proven truly that heart water is really a miracle from God because why I say from God because God created the water I did not mix the water I didn't put lemon I didn't put anything I just said playing the water in senior house I'm not selling water I only share the information what I have I benefit for myself my wife my uh, my wife parents they live in California uh, 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 they were really cute. The 85 years old and 77, they were really cute from, uh, uh, she got the diabetes, the, my, uh, my mom-in-law, uh, 33, it went to 33, can you imagine? Now she's normal, can, only her water. And also her dad, uh, she got uh, hypertension, 240 by 100, but now it's normal, 120 by, one, by 70. Yeah. Uh, her sister got uh, cancer in, in Kansas, she was cured by only hot water. All right. Okay, uh, here with the, the other formula is about, uh, I don't need to repeat about the water that gives you life, but it's about hydrogen. Scientists talk about hydrogen. You see, before I go to this, uh, you see, uh, to get hydrogen is actually the steam from the water. You have hydrogen and oxygen, H2O. So you see, everybody knows the precipitation of the you know, the raining system, you know, when, uh, you know, the water, you know, by the sun and, they, you know, heats up and then it rays to the sky because hydrogen, there's no uh, gravity with hydrogen. So it quickly goes up and then with the heat. So to get water, you need to burn, uh, hydrogen is burned by oxygen to get water. And so on the reverse to get uh, steam. All right, uh, so what I call life, hydrogen is the body's most needed, needed nutrient. Uh, oxygen burns hydrogen in the living system, releasing the energy that runs our body. So, uh, hydrogen is the fuel of our life. Uh, what is formed when hydrogen is burned by oxygen? Uh, so, hydrogen gives you good health. So, therefore, hydrogen, uh, which is a mix of, I mean, uh, water, which hot water, which is a mix of hydrogen and oxygen plus heat, gives you healthy life. So, hot water equal healthy life equal miracle. So I believe all of you may agree because you are in the Department of Biology, so you are very inclined with this. Uh, could be, you know. Uh, so benefits of hydrogen. Uh, hydrogen burns in the, the, uh, the oxygen burns hydrogen in the living system, release energy that runs our body. So the human body stores hydrogen in the, sto I mean, in the organs. The largest quantity of hydrogen is store in the liver because it's the one that protects our organs as a self-protection. So uh, hydrogen is helpful to use to hydrate our cells. So what is I call hydrogen, I mean what is formed when hydrogen is burned by, oxy, by oxygen burns hydrogen. Uh, we burn, when we burn hydrogen in our cells or when you drink hot water, how you burn hydrogen? You drink hot water, you get hot hydrogen, you know. Uh, the, it releases energy that turns our bodies. So hydrogen is the largest and smallest element known to science. So hydrogen is the smallest in all and is e easily traveled throughout our body. So when you drink hot water, you get hydrogen very easily travels all over your organs and give you an abundant, li healthy life as it happened to thousands of people, really, alhamdulillah. Uh, no electrons moves in the living system unless it is accompanied by hydrogen. The hydrogen atom is the smallest and all, and all, among all the uh, elements and has as much as antioxidant power as the large complex compound. So the liver tissues store uh, the most hydrogen. And it's very interesting as the liver is in the body's first line of defense and needs a supply of the most antioxidants in order to do its work of detoxification. So who doesn't want to be detoxified? When you are sick, is some problem with a toxic in your body. Okay, uh, uh, hydrogen is the ultimate antioxidant. This is the importance of hydrogen. So hydrogen uh, is a fuel of life. And as Albert said, Georgi, the Hungarian piece, uh, and the, who discovered vitamin C, he said that uh, the, when hydrogen is a fuel of life. He, you know. Well, our bodies need uh, store hydrogen in the living system, I mean in the uh, hydrogen pores, in the uh, organs. The greatest amount, I don't need to repeat this one, in the liver. You see, about cancer, that's why some people were cured with cancer. You need to believe 
You need to believe. You need, that's the most important. You see what they say. Cancer changes the body's biological terrain uh, in its favor to, by emitting toxins and using the body to dump its electrons in the urine and the blood becomes oxidized. What they say here, uh, cancer cells have no hydrogen in them at all. So they're not dead, your cells. A, a, a person who suffers with cancer, his cells uh, can reproduce, uh, reproduce again. So you need to drink hot water, you get hydrogen to revive the cells. That's why it's happening. We have cases of people with cancer, they were cured. Truly, they were cured. Yeah. Uh, I don't need to go with that. Uh, maybe I'll go faster because the time maybe is quite crucial. I think uh, yeah, it's uh, until one o'clock, am I right? So we'll give about 10 minutes to interact. Maybe you can just have a glimpse quickly, that one. Yeah. Yeah. Recommended method, that's very important. One or two glasses in the morning before brushing your teeth at standing position. Some people say, Sunnah Rasulullah Salam, you should not drink water by eating or standing. I say Sunnah, yeah, I'm not against Sunnah. I say only once in the morning. When? St standing. In the morning uh, before brushing your teeth. Why? I will just make very short because you have bad smell, sorry, coming from your mouth. Because your body tries to get rid of all the toxins in the body when you sleep. So by the time you wake up in the morning, you have uh, methane gas coming out of your stomach. So those are toxic to destroy you. So your body try to get rid of those toxic. So what do you need to do? Help yourself by drinking the hot water in the morning before you brush your teeth and standing because our intestine is rolling around. So you help it to, I don't say you drink altogether hot water because about 50 degree by drink like you drink chai, tea. So you, uh, maybe about four or five times or uh, and then you can finish the glass of hot water. But it's preferable about two glasses of 300 milliliters. This is about 500 milliliters, yeah. One or two glasses after brushing your teeth and three glasses at least every two or three hours. Do not exceed more than three hours because you become hungry. Some people say, I'm becoming fat. No, because you are not drinking hot water more than, um, I mean, more than three hours. So because your body gets rid of all the, sorry, the toxic, all the, I mean, the infection and all this thing, even uh, so when you pass away. So you get rid of all this. Uh, so, you, you know, so what will happen? Your body is, I mean, stomach is empty. You will have, be craving for food. But believe me, when you drink hot water before 15 minutes or half, uh, half an hour before you eat, that's a very important. You really feel that you, you, know, you don't feel hungry. It controls you, really. Okay, uh, one or two, uh, two glasses at least throughout in the evening. One glass before bed. That's very, uh, I mean, uh, that's uh, uh, maybe half an hour before going to bed so to prevent waking up from time to time while sleeping. The uh, results of drinking hot water, uh, I'll just go faster uh, to prevent various diseases, help people in pain. Yes, we got some cases of food poisoning where we were last, two, uh, last month uh, in a, uh, Bandar Khiran, we were about 50 families and uh, nine people that were attacked with food poisoning. No medicine, no hospital. They want to get to hospital. How they can reach hospital? They have food poisoning, vomiting and passing, diarrhea, sorry, loose bowel. So what happened? We just, me and my wife, keep on entertaining them and she was really trying to convince them, hey, believe, this is the only cure you. and you'll find that this is really a miracle. By from night to morning, nine people of them, including a baby. Uh, uh, how old is the baby? Seven years, seven uh, months? Uh, Gloria, seven, I mean, uh, less than one year, they, uh, she is not walking the baby. Anyway, uh, 